So we're playing Night at the Gates of Hell. Uh, it's very interesting whenever uh, games get published by Public Combo or uh, Tortured Star Entertainment. Uh, because again, it feels like some sort of a seal of approval. This game is scary. Um, I don't know really how true that is. You know me, I'm hard to scare. Uh, I'll increase the audio, or I have increased the audio, so if there is jump scares, you'll be scared. Uh, by the way, is there any nudity in the game? Any nudity, huh? Well, if we see a bunch of pixels, I'll, um, I'll yell. Hello, Nintendo fan. What a handsome fella. Oh, you're talking about me. For 100% you're talking about me. You must be talking about me. Ooh, I like that. N not me, like I read that from the chat. What a strange gate. Well, I'm glad you like the round corners, Charlotte. It now, uh, now everybody will notice the how I'm rounded in the corners of my face camera. Where is she? You told me to meet her out here. Last time I let some bitch pick the location. How could anyone get the mood out here? Isn't this based on like an Italian? B horror movies. I know uh, Puppet Combo already made one of those called uh, The Glass Staircase. Oh, am I going back? Excuse me. Ha! <laughs> Look at him. He's so handsome. He He's very happy to be here. Uh, the mouse sensitivity is uh, way too strong. How do I... There you go. Just put it on one and one. There you go. I didn't press apply. Are we in trouble? Uh, video. No, no. It actually did save. Okay, good. A little better. Man, what a pleasant ambience. The violin getting absolutely destroyed in the background. Very soothing. Wonder why the church is lit up like that. Weirdos must be having some kind of dumb service. Weirdos. What are they doing in the graveyard? Yes, there are bobs. Hopefully they're like um, Lara Croft. They're actually pyramids. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Razor! Ha ha! I can't believe I scared you. Don't be ridiculous. Of course you didn't scare me. Not even a little bit. Not even a little. After all, how can you expect a man such as myself to be afraid of someone like you, a woman? God, you have such a way with words. Oh, okay. Listen, we can really take this to the graveyard. Because in the graveyard, uh, at least we'll, we'll give the, the dead something interesting to watch. Or maybe they'll die even harder. I don't know. Whoa, are you serious? Where's the condom? Oh, uh, did you want me to use one? Nobody else has ever had a problem. Do I look like a wannabe mother to you? No protection, no action. Okay, I think I have one in the car. I'll be right back. Is there anything I can get your highness while I'm gone? You can get lost if you don't come back with a condom on your dinghy. Ah, uh, she packed us a lunch. To be frank, I don't know what was uh, scarier. Getting jump scared or seeing the pepperoni? <laughs> mm. 
By the way, did you guys see a weirdo walking around? There was a weirdo walking around. Yes, have one left. Today is my lucky day. Are you sure about that? Oh well. She made that noise? Nah, no way. She's a jump scare machine. machine. Hello, ja boy. Now this is dialogue. Absolute. This is great dialogue. My turn! Oh shit, I'm actually surrounded. Alright guys, I'ma see you later. You know what? I don't even... I don't know why I'm here. I don't even know. He really likes pepperoni. <laughs> Alright guys, listen. I'ma go to the graveyard, okay? Just show me my grave, I'll just jump in. I'm Jewish, keep in mind, so I don't want no crucifix at my grave. Man, what a bunch of weirdos. Well, that takes care of censoring stuff, yeah? Don't have to do to do any editing, would you believe it? Alright, time to read something. Most of this note is in a language you don't understand, but at the bottom in English is written, confess to me. What the hell is going on here? Ooh, pretty lights. In horror games, if you put pretty lights, I'm like a moth. I get close. It's a coffin. There is a plaque that reads, Sister Mary, may God guide you home. Why is there so much fog inside the building, huh? Sister Mary, your tran transgression have not been ignored. Bring a symbol of your repentance to me and confess your sins to be forgiven and be allowed to stay on these grounds. Right, I will. A sign of repentance? Is pepperoni okay? Just making sure there is nothing along these lines. Um, all right, I guess we're heading out. No, okay. There is a door here. Huh. The coffin. She just... You know what? I'm tired of being dead. I'm out of here. I got the crucifix. Really? All I had to do to show you that I repent is hold a crucifix? Repenting is easy. There you go. I got a key in return. Is there a way to turn on the visual effects off? CRT filter off. Oh, that's a... 
I feel like I can see the game. Is there any more effects? None. <laughs> Alright, maybe I can bring back the PSX effect. VGS. Oh, this is nice. But I want PSX. Because uh, this picture is too blurry. Even though it's nice, it's a little blurry. I don't know, uh, YouTube compression might make it really hard to see with all these dots. Last that I checked, PSX isn't dots all over the screen. Oh no, there is a figurine. Alright, I guess we'll turn it off. Wait, what is 70s? Oh, this is what I want. Look at the textures, how they're jittering. That's what I wanted. <laughs> how was that more arousing than the last scene? It seemed to have happened almost overnight. We couldn't believe what we were seeing. Everyone thought it was some elaborate hoax. We were wrong. <laughs> this is how Plants vs. Zombies started. Night at the Gates of Hell. Developed by Jordan Kinn and Henry Horay. Presented by Torture Star. Produced by all these people. Look at all these people, huh? Let's see if there is any names I recognize. Sphere Hunter, of course. Nice. Is that ammo? Anything that is remotely a box is ammo. Press F to toggle flashlight. Th thanks. Found two bullets. A knife. How do I... I have one knife. I guess I used them as ammo. Keep an eye out for knives and ammo boxes. Knives are automatically used when needed. Don't get caught by them without one. All right. Damn, so this is a full-fledged survival horror game? The love of my life. She belongs to the maggots now. Nah, I don't know what you're talking about. Still the love of my life. Looks better than whatever we saw in the previous uh, scene. Plunger could be useful. If only I could pick it up. I mean, I could stay here, but why would I? Locked. Man, this is some uh, strong ambience. Dead people in here. Well, it's locked. Is the elevator working? I need the, the power on and some protection before I get out of here. Alright, I see. Wow, what a creepy face. <laughs> they drew that in MS Paint and thought to scare me. Osophobia, thank you so much for the 22 months. Hello, don't die. Don't worry about it. I cannot die. Except that one time in the cutscene, but that's because it's forced. Thank you very much for the 22 months. Uh, Theresa, it has come to my attention that the other residents are uncomfortable, uncomfortable with the 
people who have been coming to your apartment at night. It is not my business what you do in your personal life, but their unusual appearance. Christ, just please take your meetings elsewhere. Neither me or the tenants are interested in having their sort, sort roam in our halls at night. Hilda, landlady. Oh my god, landlords are always so annoying. Always so... Fuck, I forgot the old man had some weird security system. Guess I could use... I could see the use now. I'll have to figure out on how to turn the power on to override it. So the landlord had no issues with this guy having the security system? Man. Landlords, I tell ya. It's locked. The only people I know would have a key would be the janitor in room 701 and the landlady in 702. Better start looking, I need that gun. There's a gun in there? How did you know there is a gun in there, huh? Thanks. It showed up just now. Hell. I was expecting it to say hello. Yeah, I'm not going in there. This way, this way, this way. Ankle broken. Uh-oh. I'm stuck. Hold to the crouch. There is a door right here. It's locked. Oh, that didn't sound good. Found some three bullets. I have a five and uh, what key did I pick up just now? It's a small key. There is a tag on it that says stairwell. Okay, I see. Jeffrey, you won't believe it. Those people who we keep seeing go into 704 must be part of some kind of cult. I've been hearing chanting coming through the walls some nights. It really creeps me out. They talk about the gates of hell and makes me worry for the, her two children. Imagine living with a mother who is crazy like that. This whole ordeal has me so on edge that I'm starting to see things. One night I woke up and I thought I, I saw someone in my closet. I know... Who isn't getting their lease renewed in January? Hilda. Oh, come on. Is chanting not allowed? Man, these landlords. They don't even allow a small cult. Ew, this is disgusting. <laughs> Void. Don't worry about it. Void. Alright. Time to get that gun. Uh, can I use the hammer? What's up with this guy? He's uh, smashing his spaghetti head on the on the wall. Oh, I can't see anything if I turn off the lights. That's how we know it's scary. Surprisingly, I feel like I can see more in the dark. I guess uh, the image is clearer. Maybe that's why. All right. We overcame the sophisticated security system by. Oh wait, there is some ammo here. We overcame the sophisticated security system by simply... Oh, I, I walked by the room. Ew. 
As I was saying, we overcame the security system simply by putting off the lights. Maybe it wasn't such a sophisticated system after all. <laughs> we live in a society. He like died and and then came all the way here to sit. I guess that's understandable. Do you mind? I'm in the middle of a live stream, dude. Okay, I guess he's just gonna. Oh, he he went away. He got the memo. I guess I guess he was a little uh, shy. Cause I mean, you know, we are in a live stream. He just didn't know what to do. This room has some good luck, and not not because of the horseshoe on top of the door, because there is a revolver in here. Okay, now that I have some protection, I can turn the power back on and take the elevator. I should be sure to keep my eyes peeled for any ammo that may be lying around. You never know. Hello, Blinker. Uh, whoever's reading this, please listen. You have to shoot them in the head. Nothing else will stop them. Don't find out the hard way. Press the Q key to holster or equip your gun. You cannot interact with things while your gun is equipped. Press the left mouse button to shoot and uh, to shoot and the R key to reload. Hold the space to view ammo and knives. Hold the right mouse button to aim down uh, the barrel of your equipped gun. Keep in mind that you cannot move while aiming. Oh, I need to reload. It'll take a while. Yeah, what's the deal, lady? You scared me. At least knock before you scare me. Alright, I guess we're just leaving. He's just really happy watching cans of soup. So, let's go restore the power. Clean headshot, 100 XP. That's way too much XP. Yo, what the heck just happened? <laughs> I don't know why. It sounded like... Uh, to me, it sounded like a cartoon thing. Like Tom and Jerry. Like scrambling around. Good lord, this place is falling apart. I better be extra careful. It's the zombies, I tell ya. The zombies did it. It's because of the zombies that this place is falling apart. Yo, the, I, I can hear like a fire going on. Door is locked. Got a knife. Ew, maggots. Henry and Ned are doing so well lately. My two little angels are growing up to become such great men. They are learning our ways and are excited for what awaits them. They love keeping secrets. They, they'll do anything to protect their mommy. Oh, they're good when they're following the cult, huh? Oh my god, seriously? That's just ridiculous. Look at all this. That's such a mess. Uh, Alex, thank you so much for the three months. Maggots are nature's party animals. Yeah, hey, I guess you're right. <laughs> of course, it's a goddamn crow nailed to a wall. Not my brethren. By the way, what key? An older looking key. I bet it goes to a door within this apartment. Oh, this apartment. I used a crow key. Listen, you're not a zombie, but you have to go. 
Sorry. Okay, I won't waste ammo. I mean, there is ammo right next to the monkey. I feel like I have to... I have to oblige. You little shits. I didn't even have my gun ready. What were you doing here anyway? Nerds? Um, I mean, I did open this door. This wall looks very weak. I saw a hammer around this building somewhere. I bet I can use that to break this wall. All right. Guess we have to go and break the wall. What was that sound? Was there a zombie nearby? Ah, eh, don't sweat it. Hmm. Is there a zombie nearby? I don't know, I can't tell. I cannot tell if there is a zombie nearby. I literally didn't see him, so he doesn't exist. Just perfectly ignoring people. Alright. Mommy loves you very much. Only if you're a cult, though. The portal to hell has been opened with the blood of the willing. Now the dead will walk the earth and feast on the flesh of the living. That sounds, that sounds kind of fun. I always wanted to be in... No, don't do it! Okay, it's just one eye, it's fine. If it was both eyes, that would be trouble. But if I have one eye, it's okay. Because I, I... Truth be told, you actually get better at aiming with one eye. See? One shot, one kill. See? If I had two eyes, I would miss there. Just so you know. Cobal? Who did that? <laughs> Sounds like someone is on the other side. Ew, I don't think that's a zombie. I think that's just somebody having a really bad day. All right. Well, I guess we're going this way. Damn, I won't be going back this way. You really th don't think I know that there is babies in the vents? There is babies in the vents, 100%. It's fine. I heard a power outage. It's fine. Is there ammo? I don't think so. So I can use the elevator now. What the hell? It's not working. Okay, he's dead. Let's read what did he say. Sorry, I had to skip through the text because I thought he's coming from behind. He said I need to fix it. That's all I saw. Well, I guess we're... Oh my god. 
We've been in this room before. Blanco, thank you very much for gifting five memberships. That's five people who can now post the Chrome out. Which I guess uh, aligns with your plan of having everybody cause a riot. Absolute dead. This is my apartment. There you go. I want to see if he falls down. He does not fall down. Ooh. Thank you. I think he's dead. You know, the scene before the graveyard wasn't really my cup of tea, but this, uh... <laughs> this had me feeling some feelings. There is a note here, where the man used to be. Hilda told me to hide the key to the entire building in my special place. The room means the world to me. It's everything that I had, have now, and will forever have. You mean the beans? I don't think he means the beans. Hilda? Is this guy a part of the cult? There's a safe here. The blood leads all the way over there, so... <laughs> I'm glad that they all shut up so I can read it out. It seems that I have an interesting partnership with Hilda. Now that she has given me a key to the entire building, I should have to no shortage of playthings to have access to. I wonder who I should bring to my playroom first. The mother in 704 seems like the perfect choice. It is a shame that everyone is staying indoors due to the reports coming out of the countryside. Once that blows over, I can resume my work. This guy is up to no good. Hello, Yosef. Oh, she. A true man doesn't use a gun if he doesn't have to. Wait, is that an axe that I can pick up? I cannot. I don't know where he's going, but not to kill me. Because I'm not the way. Ammo. Don't shoot the ammo. More ammo. I'm so smart. I inspected the head and it looked like I gave the head a key, but the, the head gave me a key. Now that I have the key to get to the schematics, I should turn the power back on. Otherwise, the elevator will be useless. It's a newspaper dated before everything happened. The headline reads, Fourth disappearance in as many weeks strikes fear into the hearts of the city. Man, that's rough. That was too close. I shot him twice because I didn't kill the other guy from before. So I had another bullet to spare. Sorry, he, he just, uh, he was not, uh, my, the corner of my eye did not, did not like him. He wasn't good in the corner of my eye. All right, uh, schematics. Where the heck would the schematics be? This? Come in, come all. Get knifed one by one. 
Alright, they nearly got me. Good thing I have reflexes of a goddamn bird. A crow, more, more likely. The reflex of a cat. A dead cat. Yo, look at all this blood. I almost shot accidentally because my uh, mouse hit the keyboard. I should probably carry my gun out unless uh, unless I need it otherwise. Is there some ammo hidden around here? I can smell it. Or not. Well. Whatever. Those gentle stabs made me laugh. We call those love taps. Because if I truly wanted to kill them, I would like... Bah! But they were homies, so, so I just gave them like a, a small tap. You little shits. This that room made me mad. So where would the schematics be? Can I just go to the elevator? My god! I nearly died. Oh, I'm back here. Are you cereal? To my lover boy in 705, last night was fantastic. I couldn't stop thinking about you today. You make me feel so safe. I want to give you a key that can open any door in the building as I trust you as much and want to be sure you can help me with anything. I know how forgetful you can be. So please, please keep it in your special place. Your, um, <clears throat> your mama, Hilda. Hmm. It sounds like I should take a closer look around 705. Boom, I have a key. You are under arrest. Man. That's horrible, they just killed him. What's up with the occult people? I mean, every most people are dead. So why are they still going around killing whoever's left? <gasps> he has a helmet! Get tea bagged. Get tea bagged. Okay. All right. We killed Kermit. We killed Kermit. Found four bullets. This game is way too generous. I know you guys watch me because I'm very mature. I used a special key from 705. His office should be behind that do blue door. Now that I have the key, I should be able to get in and look for those schematics. All right. This is not the blue door, but I just wanted to make sure that this place is absolutely looted. Sir? Like a hitman. Yeah. 
we have way too many bullets. That's because I I don't miss anything. What the heck? Where is this guy going? Why he he was in such a rush to die? Alright, I got uh I got the schematics. Damn, this place is falling apart by the minute. Oh, he's dead. I can't believe I missed the jump scare. That is so embarrassing. Can it be? Has she come back to me? I can't leave her now. I must go get her. My wife came back? Are you serial? That is such a good luck. How am I so lucky? Oh yeah, my wife is here. How dare. I have way too many bullets to spare. They're all dead. Alright, Violet, let's go. I'm about to do some ankle breaking. Go left, then right. Go in here. Watch out for the guy. No, there is no guy. Uh, where we should we go? I think we go out of here. The aim in this game is janky? No, my hand is just very shaky. <sighs> oh, that's my wife! are different now. Think. Think. Before the airwaves went out, it was advised to leave populated cities. There's a coastal town to the east. Perhaps others were able to fight these creatures off in open space. It's worth a try. There's no reason for me to stay here anymore. We had a safety knife. Why they call people so tall? They're taller than our main protagonist. The cult people are so tall because they have very, very high standard. Help! Oh God, someone help us! It looks like there's some people hiding in that shack. Maybe they will know something I don't. Hello, uh... sir. <laughs> sir, I know you are scared. All right, I guess they won't talk to me unless I kill, so I resolve to violence. All right, I think that's all of them, right? Yeah, that seems about all of them. Okay, now we can talk. there. Thanks for helping us out. It's very appreciated. Myself and these fine folk were going to try and sell out of here on my boat. I heard on the airwaves before that went out 
of an island. Supposedly, that's where everyone is going to try and regroup. Darn thing, is that piece of junk out there? I ain't ready for a journey that far out to sea. There's three things that we need to get ready. Since you got a gun and all, could you search the city for us? Pay attention. This is what we need. Gasoline, an engine hose, and lastly, a fuse. Find those three things and report back here. Before we get the boat up and running, you can come with us, friend. All right. Sounds good enough. No, uh, I ain't carrying a weapon. I got no interest these days. I promised my dearest Martha I'd never touch a gun again. Personally, I don't care if I live or die. I joined up with these folks to see if I could help, but I just froze up when things got dicey. I just want to go out a hero serving the greater good. Something that Uncle Sam lied to me about a long time ago. I want to die for a reason, you know? Something that'd make Martha proud. Hey man, thanks for bailing us out. I don't have a gun, but I'll try my best to be useful. I was here on vacation, right before the shit hit the fan. Just soaking up the sun one minute. Then the next looking up and seeing some smelly motherfucker won my insides on the outside. I found that mother and a creepy son over there. They were almost done for. Then us three stumbled upon this place with the captain and Skeeter. I don't know the city very well, but but I know I heard what sounded like a shotgun coming from the dance school. Just take a left once you leave and follow the road. You'll see the build. A shotgun might be better than that old revolver you got there. Good luck out there. My man, thank you. I can't explain it. But it seems like the undead are being controlled by a greater force. They perhaps aren't as mindless as they seem. <laughs> that is pure speculation on my part, though. I just know I'm so glad you found us. My baby boy Charles and I were starting to lose hope. I really want that shotgun. Let's go. Oh, he's just dead. Let's scour the boat. There might be some ammo in there. Never mind. Never mind. Well, I guess we're off to scour the city. Uh, that's not a school dance floor, I don't think. Hmm. Oh, shells. Found some shells. I fear something terrible is about to overtake our town. Father Friendstein has been most strange lately. His eyes. It feels strange to say, but his eyes bring one word to my mind. Death. He doesn't seem to be the same. I fear the devil has gotten to him. Playing tag with the devil? Whoa! <laughs> the heck? A lollipop coming to kill me? I'm not dying to any stinking lollipop. A goddamn enlightened one came to kill me. He reminds me of the enlightened from uh, Lunacid. Brains, but no head. How did that happen? That's what we call a smooth brain. He was thinking so hard. He melted his goddamn face off. On some more shells.
Found a key. I don't... This doesn't look like a skull to me. Reminds me of Cry of Fear. What, the smooth brain? Dr. St Stiglitz had a lock installed on some of the doors. I think it has to do with the corpses that have had been going, going missing. Being the strange bird that he is, he doesn't want anyone to know the code. He even went as far as to rip the paper the code was written on in two. I know one half is kept in his pocket, but who knows where the other half could be. This room is empty. What happened? Wasn't there a guy dead? Ha! Huh. Must be my eyes playing tricks on me. Must be my imagination. Listen, give me one part of the code, I'll guess the rest. Deal? Nerds. This guy's alive. Never mind. He's just slightly less mutilated by by the others. His head was trailing behind his body, so to shoot him and kill him you need to go from behind. A very smart. Look like it's a half of a code. I got one half, but who knows where the other would be? Got a knife. <laughs> Does he? Yeah. He He's not following me. Oh, no, no, he is, he is. What the? The axe blocked my shots. He literally boogied around my gun. the other part to be if I should try and like shoot like the neck because that's was his head level but behind the body so maybe that would go through his neck and hit his head hmm I don't see no paper. I came to one of the rooms in the morgue. Wait, there's a locked room in the morgue? Since when did I pick up a key? Huh. 
Huh. How many? Oh, he's zero. I found one. I guess that's something. Look like it's the other half of the goad. From the desk of Dr. Stiggs. St Stiglitz. Father Frankenstein and I have hit a snag in our understanding. I am expected to provide the corpses for his endeavors, but I simply cannot keep up with his demand. The whole situation is becoming noticeable. I will have to inform him of my decision to end our agreement tonight. Uh oh, Father Stiglitz isn't going to be happy. You say he might even get mad. Possibly. <laughs> Alright, what does what is it going? Oh, I just Okay. Well, I found a fuse. Oh, they're not chasing me. Oh, they're like the enlightened ones. Oh, wait, no, they still have their brain, I think. Yeah, yeah, the brain is still there. There is a brain in there. Did I get him? Whatever. I don't know where the head is. I'm not going to even figure out. He, his head and his ass looks the same. I, I cannot tell the difference. All right. Uh, one down. I guess uh, more to go. Some ammo, that would be very nice. That's where he came from. You can tell by the guy being hanged and all. Oh, he has a crucifix. I don't think he can p kill people with crucifixes. Well, there's something interesting up ahead. Is that Slender Man? Man, how he do that? It lives under what the floor. The hell was that? Made me black out there for a while. I need to get out of this house and get back on track. The sooner we leave this city, the better. All right. There's something rustling around the around under the floor. It keeps waking the whole family up at night. Uh, the little one is particularly scared, it seems. I have to admit, I've been pretty on edge too. I'm sure it's just a rodent, but sometimes I feel silly for writing this down even. Sometimes I think I see someone looking up at, the, at me through the floorboards. I'll have to get some mouse traps in the market tomorrow and put an end to this. Someone is a wee little scared. It can speak. What, what, what does it say? <laughs> huh. 
<laughs> I was not expecting that. I thought I might have to drop in there and not get jump scared. It looked like the lady from SpongeBob. The the very old nanny. The one who is just like a corpse in a wheelchair. Oh, I actually shot his ass and it killed him. He is an ass face. This guy is alive. No, no, he's dead. I thought he was just pretending to be a zombie. Uh... No, 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 no. Okay, I guess we're locked in here. Oh, well. Okay, it didn't... It didn't let me aim for whatever reason, so I just went for it. Wait, she seems like... She seems normal. She had a crucifix. I couldn't tell the difference. She seemed like such a nice lady. Well, I found the gasoline. Now all that he's left is a hoe. Meet me upstairs at 9 p.m. My mom should be asleep and I can sneak out. She's really mad when she found out about us. She wouldn't stop talking about how satanic our relationship is. Ever since dad died, she just clings to the old crucifix like it's the only thing she has. She needs to get over it. Who knows? Maybe being dead isn't all that bad. No, no, that's satanic. Oh, that did not hit him. Is he coming down here? He's dead. That's a big door. Big door for big people, I guess. I'm expecting to see some big zombies. That is literally not what I thought. <laughs> I I was aiming high for a big zombie and there was a, a little kid. Stop moving. Alright, we're good. Uh, was I supposed to drop down here? Gee, I don't know. Some gasoline. A fuse. So I guess we'll go. I would really like to find a school. But I don't know where I am in this uh, town. I didn't want to aim down downside because aiming makes it so that you cannot move and they move really fast. That was a close call. Have two bullets to my name. <laughs> this is so fun. Triple kill. That was a humiliation. Uh, there is a shovel. Is this where the school is?
Hmm. Goodbye, Blinker. Thank you for hanging out with us. All right, well... Yeah, I guess we'll just go this way. I'm sure we'll come across the school any day now. Um, that's where we came from. What's that over there? Oh, that's these guys. I see. Is this door open? No. This is back to the morgue. Oh, there is something inside the morgue. I'm not going there. Chris, the door is literally right from that dead end to your right. Dead end. Are we talking about the school? I came from here originally. This is back here. I might be a little lost. Should I go back to them? Hmm. From the guys came from... Oh, you mean when I got ambushed. Very much locked. Dead end. Go back to the nerds in the cabin. The black robed guys came from the door of the left. 
No, this one is also locked. I, I don't know, man. It's all locked. I think I'll just go back to the cabin, guys. I think I am supposed to go back to them. Hmm. Hey, this is green. I've been here. This is where I blew this guy's brain out. Literally, he had one brain. Just a brain hanging around. Oh, there is another street. I didn't see there was another street right here. Well, then why keep this lock, dummy? I don't have a lot of ammo. Oh, where? Which way do we go? I, I think we better find the school. Uh, I guess this looks like a school. I'm just gonna... Oh no, I can't even go in there. A barn house? There's a side room. Well, not very much a side room, just uh, a way across, I guess. Was I was I supposed to be here? I guess not. I really want that shotgun. The key should open that gate. I'll try. No, a key to the room in the morgues. You do not have a key for the gate. Oh, d don't. Don't be a creepy thing. Wait, this is the school? This is something strange about Headmaster Emmanuel. Ever since she joined that new church, she has been short with the students. In fact, there are a number of people in this village who have been acting peculiarly. I can't put my finger on it, but something is happening right under our noses. With a gun equipped, press the E key to swap. Well, I don't th think it really changes the gameplay. I think we still have to go for the head. Any... Alright, I'll just leave. Well, it all went through her head. Sorry, I just, uh...
Oh, I thought somebody is coming from behind. Well, I killed one more. There you go. They're all dead. I know there was nothing here. I just wanted to flex my power over them. I just had to show them that I'm very good at horror games. Uh, we need a hose still, don't we? Hmm. Oh, this guy has armor. What do you say? Uh, the the creeping. Uh, I finished reading quickly, so I can deal with him. Well, now what? Oh, this door just opens. I think we're supposed to go upstairs and jump to the other building. I'm so smart. Let's go. I'm gonna stop attempting to hip fire unless I absolutely have to. Because it seems like bullets do not exist if you don't aim. Let's just make sure this whole place is clean. No, I don't want to lose my other eye. How the hell am I supposed to shoot without my monitor? Because technically if I lose my second eye, it's like turning off the monitor. This guy's still running around. Alright, let's uh, put this away so we can put the board. And now equip our gun. Stupid zombie. Mama locked them all in the basement. Her and Papa blocked the staircase because the basement might not hold them. So now we just leave upstairs. It's impossible to tell how many days have passed because the sky is blood red constantly. Mama and Papa only cry and read the Bible now. They say Satan is coming for our souls. Satan. Well, they don't seem to be around. All right, that is unfortunate for you. That is unfortunate for you too. Hopefully nothing jumps out. There you go. That closet is very suspicious. Very conveniently uh, placed ammo in front of the closet right here. I'm going to pick up the key now. There's an indication, indication what this go goes to. There is no indication what this goes to, but I assume it opens one of the doors in the farmhouse. <laughs> that doesn't sound good. He's dead. Hmm. 
Hmm. I think it uh, came from the stairs. No, nope. okay, just random sound. All of them are gonna get up, right? Found the hose. Come on, get up. I know you guys are gonna get up. Come on. Oh, wait, you have no heads. Never mind. Except this guy. This guy has a face. Uh, what the? It's locked now. <laughs> They're just jumping around. Oh, where, where did this guy come from? And I shot this guy in the face. Why is he not dead? Is the door magically unlocked now? Now that I have shot them? Of course it is. The head just went upstairs, locked the door with his jaw. He he bit the lock and turned the, the key, I guess. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh no, not face dogs. No. <laughs> I think they're dead. Is that all of them? How'd they know I'm here? They just knew that I was in the front door. They were like, get him now! Go, go, go! Everybody just swarmed. Alright, I think we have everything. We have the gasoline. We have the fuse and we have the hose. Let's get out of here. Oh yeah, they're all uh, still alive. Hey, thank you for the shotgun tip, sir. Capitan? Ah, you scurvy dog! I am. That's all we need to leave this hellhole. This boat up and running in two shakes of mermaid tits. So, um, it looks to me we are about right here. That's a completely different ocean there, Cap. Oh. I cannot believe this. I thought you were a captain. Why haven't you the faintest idea of where we are? Okay. Since we're all friends now, can I lay down some truth? Fact is, I'm just a cabin boy, okay? The furthest my knowledge goes with directions is that the sun rises in the west and sets in the east. Rises in the east and sets in the west, Cap. Fuck! This is ridiculous. We escaped those flesh-eating monstrosities to become stranded out at sea without any food. When it comes down to it, I vote cooking to Kevin Boy first. Calm down, everyone. I'm sure once this fog clears up, we can get our bearings and eventually come across some land. In the meantime, let's all take a rest. 
We've been on our feet for a long time. You are quite right. Come, Charles. It is your dinner time. Yes, Mommy. Now, I think it's... I think it's important that we... Uh, we need to keep our guard because I have a bad feeling that... Will you kindly shut the hell up back there? God damn. Thank you. <clears throat> As I was saying, I just think we should be on our toes. Oh. Hello, Stan. Something ain't sitting right with me. And I'm not talking about Captain Clueless over there. Something came in this fog. I don't think we're alone out here. I'm going to keep my eyes open. Nothing good ever happens on foggy nights. I'm watching you, mister. You stay away from my mommy. There'll be problems, big problems. I'll make sure you end up just like Daddy did. Okie dokie. I can't believe we made it out of that hellish village. Once I put my Charles to sleep, please come back and see me. I'd like to express to you how grateful I am. <laughs> It's an old Polaroid of some soldiers. On the back of it, it reads, Things will get better once we get back home, brother. Joe. Hey, did you interrupt it, Skeeter? I miss my wife when we were dating. After I got home from the war, she was the only thing I had going for me. Got chased out of our hometown because I had the audacity to get drafted. She uprooted her whole life and came with me though. Now I realize how much she held me together. I'm not sure what I believe in. But if I wasn't afraid of her, I'd be going to hell. I'd throw myself in that murky water without a second thought. She was perfect. I have to do what I can to make sure we go to the same place. Two days without her is enough. I couldn't stand eternity. I'm sorry for the depressing sentiments, but it was either that or another war story. Damn. Stormy night. Ammo? No ammo. Okay. Everyone's pissed at me, huh? Honestly? I didn't think we were getting out of that shack. No? I lied about no one giving an island and how to get there. I just didn't want everyone else to die hopeless. I don't know what side Moss Grow is on, but I do know one thing. I have hope we'll make it out of this. Oh, Captain Boy. Oh, shit. Captain Boy. Davy Jones' freaking locker. What was that? Someone check the motor around back. Something hit it. There were sitting ducks out here. We have to check it out. Y'all be safe. Ah, shit. Don't worry, I got him. What? Don't worry, guys, I got him. I like to tease him. I let him get close to the boat and then I shoot him. Boss Battle 1. 
That kid's gonna be so mad. Everyone, get in! Stan, come on! That thing will swallow us whole! We've got no other choice! Actually, we do. You all get going. What are you talking about? I stay with the ship and keep his attention. You all just roll like hell and don't look back. Soldier, that's suicide. I'll catch up. Go! Come get me, you rotten piece of shit! <laughs> Man, I guess he really couldn't stand the whole pack, huh? He was just like, you know what? Fuck it, I'm not even going on the boat with you guys. Mommy, my mommy is okay, right? Yeah, she's in the shark's tummy. Fully intact. Stan, he, he saved our lives. We should have been me. That man is a hero. We can't let his death be in vain. Hey, Captain Boy. I can't believe this. That well, wasn't no regular shark. Now where the fuck are we? He's so sad he doesn't speak up. Alright, I think we made it to the island, right? This looks like an island. Look at it. A very red though. Alright, I'm first into the maze. Whoa. The JPEGs here are very strong. I have six bullets, just enough to kill anything moving in this JPEG. Stan! <laughs> he died a hero. Stupid, but a hero. Another graveyard, seriously? Uh oh, I think I heard the gate lock. Whoa! That nearly could have been me, even though I cannot run into the grave. I nearly fell into the grave. Alright, what do we have here? I would shoot the lock, but I doubt this game has this kind of logic. So, I'm not even gonna try. The Muslim, or whatever it is, is closed. There is some rattled coffins. And some ammo by the dead. You know, even dead people need protection. Oh, this is open. I did not expect it to be open. <gasps> Hello? Is anyone out there? Oh my god. I thought I was alone here. Look, I don't have a lot of time left. I'll explain all this later, but the keys to the gate and my coffin should be inside of the mausoleum next door. Please find them and get me out of this thing. I'll tell you whatever you want to know about what we're facing when you get me out of here. All right, Susie. I'll get you out of here so you can make another analysis on Resident Evil. The remake. Let's go help Susie make some content. Who is this guy? Nerd. That is more arousing than the beginning of the game. How? I guess I just don't like pepperoni. Alright, one of you guys has a key. If I had a tool, I could probably open this. I did pick up a crowbar. Oh, I guess I, 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 guess I didn't. Oh, this guy has a hat. Well, cheek shot. Shot him in the cheek. <laughs> well, now where do we go?
<laughs> Trying to pull a fast one on me, huh? All right, let's go help. Sir? Anybody else? They look quite fancy. By the way, what was the key doing inside that coffin? Like, how did it get here? Susie has some explaining to do. Uh oh. Really? That was really fast. How did you become a zombie so fast? She became a zombie so fast! Alright, well, I guess I'll get out of here then. Use Sphere Hunter key. Oh, I see what you did there. Might as well put YouTube slash Sphere Hunter key. Might as well open a YouTube channel called that, huh? Beware. Demons beyond this point. Turn back now. May God save your soul. A regular old Monday for me. Just a good old Monday. This will never get old just playing with a gun. I'm gonna see Tommy again, or uh, the boy. I consider him a demon. All right, let's uh, investigate. The demons are requiring more sacrifices each day. We are running out of animals to offer them. We must think of way of a way to escape this curse, or face that we mu what we must do when there are no more to offer. I mean, do you have to offer? You can just make, like, a really good food. Ever since they arrived to our island, there has been an imbalance. I don't know what god they worship, but it isn't the one that I care to know. They are obsessed with death. Oh, this sounds like Satan. Satan to me. Oh, was that Satan? That was Satan, huh? Alright. Listen, if Satan is a JPEG, we have some problems. This room is just empty. Probably a setup for something else. Or maybe just a, a piece. Just making sure nobody's underneath the, the houses. You never know. We must all leave this place. Under night we have packed everything that we can. And hope that we can escape what is to come. Escape? We came here... To be saved. Damn. Demons? Captain. Hey Rez, do you plan on playing the new nun game? Oh, the evil nun game? Uh, I think they offered me a key. So maybe. I'll check my uh, mail, my inbox for to see if they sent me a key for the game. About time you woke up. 
After you never came back, we went looking for you. Rotting landlubbers jumped us. I don't know what happened to Skeeter and that little freak, but they're probably around here somewhere. I noticed your cell door was about to fall off its hinges when they threw you in. Let me tell you, I'm glad you were out, because they played with your butthole real good. I'm just kidding. Calm down. Try and find the others and a key to get me out of here. There's gotta be a way out of this place. Oh, and watch out for the guards. They've got guns, but I don't think they can hear anything. Must have maggots in the air canals or something. Just don't let them see you. Good luck. Never let us down before. Well, except for when you left us and got your ship busted up. I'm glad this captain cares for me. What the heck is this book? David, it looks like a journal. There are some words and a picture of some kind of book. It reads, whoever finds this, you might be our last hope. I don't know exactly how, but the gates of hell have been opened by a man who is, a, who is in possession of an ancient book that appears to guide him. If the book can open the gates, then surely it must also detail a way to close them. You must wrench the book from this, his grasp. Do this and find a way to se sever the ties between our world and hell itself. Okay, I guess I know what I need to do. Okay. All right, Peter, Skeeter. Man, I'm really strong. I don't think there was anyth anything wrong with the door per se. I think I was just really strong. Wait, they just put a human mannequin in that jail cell? Imagine your jail business is going so poorly you have to put in mannequins so that people think that you arrested people. These cult people are a joke. Well, at least they took my guns. I guess that complicates things, huh? There is some ammo, I guess. cleaned his head clear off if he had booger in his nose I cleaned it just now that's how accurate the shot was just now oh I'm trying to interact using the E button better not yet I'm not sure what it does could be an alarm imagine if you just activate the alarm by accident it's okay they have maggots in their ears or ears in their maggots What kind of a... Uh, this doesn't look satanic to me. Oh my god, Skeeter, is that you? No, they're gonna lure me in here for ammo. I won't be dumb. Who leaves ammo and a knife in a jail cell, anyway? I mean, it, if they closed the door, I would have looked so dumb. But they didn't. So they look dumb. TSM, thank you so much for the $20 on Super Chat. It's really nice to see you streaming on the original channel. Have an awesome day, best friend. Thank you very much for the $20 uh, Super Chat. I appreciate that. And yeah, I stream every Sunday on the channel. Oh. <laughs> You know what? I think I forgot to uh, advertise my, uh, well, second channel. Not really advertise, but I'm going to leave a link in the chat. Uh, since all the content in the stream I upload to the second channel. So there is a link in the chat if you're uh, interested in that. Oh, yeah, I have I've ignored uh, Prisoner. Dig this. 
There's cameras set up all over the place. If you see one, be sure to stay out of its light. You can't shoot them either. Bulletproof, obviously. Oh, also, there are doors all around this place that can only be opened by finding the panel that controls it. Get out of this block, you'll have to find the office and hit the switch. All right, prisoner. I would really like if you gave me your name, but hey, that'll do. All right. That was that, I guess. Oh, uh, excuse me. Burp demon. Haven't happened in a while. All right. Well, I guess I'm just uh, leaving. So we set a panel in a... So I guess I know what the button does. That opens something, right? Did I just teleport forward somehow? I, I felt like I was much closer to them all of a sudden. Because I started going back uh, when they opened the, the thing. Well, I found some ammo. How much bullets? I have 16 bullets. Crazy. I should free everyone first before going in there. Cover? <laughs> I am the faster draw. <laughs> Look at this cultist, he's so sad. It says ammunition, I really want to get in there. I'll need a key. So there is a hammer here in case I need. You know what? I'll pick it up. I got a feeling that it'll be useful. I think that's a bulletproof glass. Is there anybody else in the room? Nope. Oh wait, that's Skeeter! Skeeter! I gotta get, at, uh, get in there. From the desk of Father Freightston. We have finally found a location where the ritual must take place. It is an island off the coast. Once we have opened the gates of hell, nothing will stand in our way. The book will lead us from he there. Oh my god. Father Fredstein. So we literally came to the island where it is the most dangerous. Not ideal in an apocalypse, but oh well. I got a hammer. Oh no, I, I used the hammer to get a key. Hmm. Whatever happened to the newer dungeon of Fear and Hunger? Newer dungeon. I don't know what the, what newer dungeon are we talking about. I want to go back to the ammunition area. Lots of ammo. Where
Where'd you come from? I literally searched this room when I heard the... Well, I'm glad I came into this room. So, have I opened the room of some kind? Go, go, go! It looked like there was a gap for me to go through. Alright, there is no more people here. Cover. Have you ever heard of it, dummy? Could help you next time. No. I shoot first. There's a lot of cameras here. Cell block B. Did he kill him? I think. My mama. I couldn't protect her. I, I can't get her voice out of my head. She keeps calling to me. She wants me to join her. She smells rotten. Really? Was it because I touched the door? Damn, my bad. Next time I'll be sneakier, I promise. Damn, he's straight up dead. He just died. Is this one of the buttons that I gotta press? No. That was a close call. I was surrounded. Outnumbered. Cornered. That's a long gun the Red Cult have. It's not how long it is, it's how you use it. And they use it with one hand, which is why it's ineffective. Why do they hold such a big gun with one hand? Every single time. Where, where am I? I thought this was the way out. I'm so clueless. Check your corners whenever you're in a survival horror game. Oh, I got a key. It literally killed every single zombie, so there shouldn't be any zombies. Damn, Skater is dead. What happened to his chest? Damn, I guess uh, somebody cut him open. Huh, that's scary. You Who would do th that? Me? I thought only mommy cared. There's some open vents behind me. 
I was too scared to go in. I'll hide there until you're ready to leave. I'll be at the gate in the courtyard when we're ready to leave. You might want to go in there too and see where they go. Mister, thank you. I nearly shot Sorry, you. You scared me. You look like a goddamn zombie. <laughs> I nearly shot him and got the super bad ending. Does he not look like a goddamn demon? A hell spawn. I got another key. Listen, you need more than loud sounds and jump scares to scare me. It's a note. It seems to be from one of those cult goons. Before they completely turn, it reads, I love her. Even as my heart rots and the voices of hell call to me, I will hide her away so that they can't find her. And I hope that after I am consumed by death, I will have a place for her within my heart and come and visit her sweet rancid corpse whenever I desire. How romantic. Damn, I can't see a damn thing. Whoops. I shot a man. Was he a bad? I'll, I'll just say he was a bad guy. That'll make me feel better about myself. I didn't kill him for nothing. So what did that do? I guess that opened the way forward? Good. All the cult goons are dead. Um, uh oh. Uh oh. Ha, <laughs> close one. Actually, not even close. Let's see. Uh, there is a big ass gate over here. Something tells me it's not electronically locked. There is nothing here. Did I not press the X button? I remember pressing it. Oh well, I guess we'll have to go back. That's a big crucifix. Stupid camera. Uh, we're gonna... whoops. We're gonna have to press the X button. In the meantime, I'm gonna stand. Because I've been sitting. What are you... You think you're gonna get a drop on me? Not gonna happen. Oh, this uh, camera is already re retired. I heard talking. There should be enemies nearby. Like cult members, like with a black hood. Oh well, I guess they're gone. Chest trim. Yeah, I guess it is a, a chest trim.
Oh man. Maybe I should consider getting a different chair because this one really hurt. Destroys my back. My fear is that I'll buy an office chair and then that office chair will destroy my back regardless. There was an office chair I had my eye on. But I just don't know how, like, like how actually comfortable it is. Now we have to get it out of the courtyard. Wasn't this wa the way out to the courtyard? Oh, it was, it was. Bobbing and weaving. I gotta sit for this. Uh. Risk, I think you can shoot the glass and get skitter. I don't. I don't trust this game to have this kind of logic in the game. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I shoot first. Yeah, it's kind of scary in here. Huh. Probably my eyes playing tricks on me. Well, since I'm here, I might as well press the circle button. So now the way back is locked. have five knives okay go 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 I have a ton of bullets Still need to find a key, huh? Hmm. Oh yeah, I've been here. Huh. That's like the... That gate is like the exit, so I probably shouldn't. Is there something over there that I haven't checked? Maybe. A key that reads a surgery room. Oh, okay. That was... I know where it is. Out of here. Hey, it's not my problem, he's blind. He had his chance. Skeeter! Thank you, soldier. It looks like they were about to do some kind of mumbo jumbo on me. I swiped a key while they were bringing me in here. You take it. It looks real important. Has a strange symbol on it. Say you found others too. We'll meet up with them and we'll wait for you. These undead lunkheads won't hell. Go give it to them. What a what a true war hero. He's just a hero. 
Give me that. Alright, Skeeter. Thank you. For whatever reason, I thought Skeeter was uh, back at the cell with the boy. I thought the boy killed him. <laughs> Alright. Letter A. You got a A key. Does that go to the... Hey, boy. You're okay. Oh, thank God you didn't forget about me. I'll hide until you're ready to leave. I'll meet you at the gate when you are. I really thought my ass was grass there for a second. Don't worry, no grass here. All right, now we just need to save the captain. Wait, I still have a key. Was that not what I used the key for? Wow! You actually came through! Knew you could do it. I'm going to lay low. Let's all meet at that big gate in the courtyard. Once you've got everyone free, we'll blow the sardine stand. Listen. You could say the captain is full of shit, but I believe in, in him. He fixed the boat just like he said he would, and maybe now he's gonna blow this whole place sky high. Oh shit. I missed! I didn't miss, I w that was just a warning shot, just so you know. A for cell block, eh? Damn. He had no chance. He just died. Wait, do we have everybody? What about Skeeter? Oh, damn. I think we do have Skeeter. Let's go. <laughs> oh, shit! I had no chance. What the heck is that? Well, whatever it is, it's dead. Dummy. Alright, let me get all the ammo. And let's get out of here. What the heck? Cerberus? Disgusting. <laughs> okay. I agree. Should I shoot him? I don't know who it's that gate is. Too late, you know. The gates can no longer be shut. As this world rots and withers away, my work here is done. Now I receive my reward. Yeah. 
He dead? Come on, give me that book. Give me that book. I think this book is what caused all this to happen. Maybe it can also stop this madness. Uh oh. I think they know. Wait, they have maggots in their ears. How would they hear the alarm? Oh boy, I gotta get out of here. Uh oh. Homer Simpson they really got me. Okay. <laughs> that uh, to that guy was a half man, yet he was uh he nearly was the one who killed me. I think there was an enemy over there, but I don't know. I think I killed him. That seems like a fun thing to do. Does it really matter if I get found out by the camera? Like, really? Alright, I'll wait. He doesn't want to fight. I'm not gonna fight him. I'm not gonna fight somebody who doesn't want to fight. He raised his gun at me. He was coming for me. He saw when I killed his friend, he was like, damn, I did that. It's because of me. And then uh, he prepared his gun to shoot me. Look at what the cult is doing to people. Why do the enemies look like Teletubbies? Uh oh. One knife for, for good measure. Ah, go, go through the door. Alright, let's go. They call me the Crevice Hunter. Damn, I cannot crevice shot. Never mind. Oh, these are more allies. I nearly Looks crevice like shot my allies. It's deserted. I'll say it's quieter than a mute nun's pussy on Christmas morning. <laughs> hey now, there's a kid around. You're buck ass naked swinging that damn schlong around. And you want to tell me to keep the kid in mind? Also, I'm just gonna come out and say it. Oh, even sure that's a kid? Come on. We have more important things on our plate. Let's look around. We know they're coming for us. We need to protect this book. Maybe we can reverse whatever has happened. The dream team. That kid is a demon. This isn't a bad place to try and defend. I should look around for some more firearms and pass them out to the others. Gonna need all the help I can get. Damn, I uh, wasted most of my ammo crevice hunting, huh? Didn't I get like a ton of shells? I remember I didn't use the shotgun. I think they took away my ammo. Alright, let's look around. Is this tower defense now? 
or if uh, if by towers you mean um, just uh, old men with guns, then yes, it is. I thought uh, I looked at the rack and I thought it's uh, like a stick laid over a bunch of metal. I thought like the stick is like a weapon. As if somebody used that stick as a weapon. That's a, a very dark wall. I think that's because the, the wall does not return light. Which is impossible. But hey, I don't uh, I don't argue with walls. He's still naked. Looking for some more guns? My guess would be inside the church. Say, what do you think this place is? Looks like it used to be some kind of mission to the locals. You think this was where that cult first started? I'd be careful looking around if I were you. No, I'm not gonna find some pants. It'll just slow me down. Thanks for saving our asses back there. Look, I know this might be the end of the road, but it'll be an honor fighting with you. If we can find some more guns, hell, I'll take one up again. I think Martha would forgive me and be proud. Forgive and be proud? That's hella combination. There's no uh, ammo around as far as I could tell, so... I guess there's some meat, but... I don't know how much... Uh, how well meat will do as a weapon. It's locked. I'll need to find a way in. Well, goddamn. Oh, the demon. Everyone's being so glum. We didn't get through everything we did just to die in this hellhole. This captain might abandon his ship, but he sure as hell ain't going to abandon his crew. Good words, cabin boy. I want to comment about the naked man, but at the same time, I don't want to. I want to fight like everyone else. Don't treat me like a kid. Give me a gun. I'll spray brains all over these walls. Uh, we found a naked man, and ever since then, he's been naked, and no one questions it. He's gonna spray brains all over the wall like. Man, uh, that's the funniest shit I've ever heard. Oh, secret passage. I don't know what's lurking down here, so I better get my gun. Oh, I'm inside the armory. The armory is not empty. I got guns. All right, kid. Time to spray some wa uh, some brains on the walls. There you go. Hey, 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 hey! Damn, he wasn't kidding. He really did spray brains on the walls. Mad respect for uh, holding his uh, word. Please don't shit yourself, please. I need some men to uh, to help me in this mission. No, no, no! Come on. Okay, he's not. <laughs> He's not going to shoot himself. Alright, guys. We're all ready. Tommy Boy is ready. Let's go get some cult. Oh shit. Protect. Why is there all of a sudden ammo around? Get him. I can do this all day. I think you dropped your brain. Alright. 
I think I'm ready to fight, guys. Damn, I'm so good. Oh, wait. They I wanted to look so cool, but they didn't shoot them. I could have looked so cool. Wait, what? What happened to my knives? I had like 10. I wanted to look super cool, but it didn't happen. Where did that guy come from? All right, guys, focus fire. Good job, Skeeter. By the way, shouldn't we do something with the book? Oh, so that's where they came from. Damn it. I gotta reload. Don't worry, guys. I got this. Man, Skitter just like 180 headshot him. Hey, don't aim that shit at me. Like I think you dropped your brains. There's more coming. We need to fall back. No, not the naked man. Naked man down. Give me that ammo. Watch out. We have a half man. Good job, Skeeter. Thank you for uh, saving me. Wait, there's some ammo there. I can't get it. Oh no. Seems like they busted in. True survival horror, what can I say? Hey, that's the guy you killed! Tight, Martha. I'm coming for you. I have to avenge my friend. We can't hold any longer. Fall back to the church. <laughs> no, not Skeeter. Whoa. He just tore out his hand. I guess Martha would be sad and proud. Oh, it's been a hell of a ride. No one else I'd rather die beside. Now, let's blast some brains. Alright, let's do that. Yeah, I'm out of ammo. Reloading, Captain. Oh, sh uh oh, Captain, they're coming from behind. Well, shit. Uh-oh, we're surrounded. Uh, now we're truly surrounded. Come get me, you smelly-ass maggot fuckers! 
Did you ripped off his hand? This is it. There's nowhere else to run. Ah, uh, cramp. <laughs> this is where I'm going to die. It's the fast ones that are going to get me. How are you here? Lewis? Was it Lewis? I may have forgotten your name, but not your spirit. Sorry to crash the party. Stan. Sorry to crash the party. Oh, I did say I catch up with you. Now follow me if you don't want to be dead. Stan, my man. Oh wait, that was it? Wasn't I supposed to stop the, the gates with the, the, the book? Well, that was Night at the Gates of Hell. There's gonna be a part two. All right, I guess I'll check it out when it's out. Stan, what? Did he just come out through a portal with a gun he stole in the Vietnam War? I think he did. Uh-oh. What? I think you need to read that book and see if there's anything about getting back home. Home? Cause we sure as hell ain't in Kansas anymore. 